Okay, this is Minecraft, but with redesigned wolves. Man's best friend has been remade to provide you with some new friends, some new items, and even some new investment opportunities. <laughs> just, just kidding. But there's a particularly nasty wolf we'll need to watch ourselves around that we'll be getting to near the end of today's video. All right, let's check out the wolf remake by Caleb, known as the Sheepdog. It's a new wolf that does its best to blend in. <sighs> Why do I already have a feeling about this? It goes into a herd of sheep, then kills them. When near sheep, it will attack them like a regular wolf. However, it has something extra for far away sheep. Okay, well, let's see some sheep. Lovely. Wow. You guys look like you are definitely all 1,000 count. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to make you into a bed. Sheepdog. Ha! Oh, look at you. Ha! Is that a detonation button on top of it? What kind of sheepdog is this? Oh my gosh. Well, it is definitely a wolf in sheep's clothing, I have to say. This is, um, I've read fairy tales about you. So what does it mean by far away sheep? I'm a little confused. Okay, so I just summoned a sheep very far from the wolf sheep, okay? And I want to see what it's all about, or sheep dog, whatever it likes to call itself. Come on, buddy! Okay! <laughs> well, he's firing meteors. Whoa! Good boy! Okay, he's firing off another one. I don't know where this one's about to head. Wow, that is a very far away sheep. <laughs> here we go, here we go. Oh my gosh! He's gone mad with power! I want him as a pet. Okay, apparently you can shear this guy. <gasps> oh! Oh gosh, he's mad at me! I mean, I get it. I just took his skin from him, essentially. Okay, okay, okay! Easy! Enraged wolf! We you can't shoot your rockets at me now, can you? Oh, well, I'm dead. Oh. They likely won't like that, so you'll probably want some. Well, that's good to know. Okay, he's doing his thing over there. What did we get? We got wolf. <laughs> Do we get anything if we take him out? Let me see. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Wow, you have a lot of health, don't you? Yeah! Whoa! Did he just drop a weapon? Oh, this was what was on his back. Weaponized Ordnance Launching Firework Plat... No, it stands for wolf. The P is silent. This can be used to shoot rockets at annoying, terrible sheep. Okay, well, we'll use that in a second. First of all, we can also use the wool to get wolf armor. Check this out, don't mind if I do. Howl at the moon, boys. We got a nice speed boost as well as an invisibility boost. That's pretty cool. When you wear it, you're faster, invisible, great for sneaking around, not bad. Oh gosh. Okay, so if I shoot this off, what? where's it, is it gonna? Is it gonna like target the nearest sheep? It, wow, wow, that has some serious <laughs> range. I wanna see the aftermath. <laughs> Lovely. Yes, yes. How many of these can I fire at once? Oh my gosh, like infinite it looks like? Bro, oh, this is so fun. Dude, they're going nuts. <laughs> so many explosions. Poor guy never stood a chance. Oh, he lived. Well, all right, so we're checking out Doge, courtesy of Ambiguous Chameleon. Much wolf, very fun. Wow, messed that one up. <laughs> the Doge is a dear beloved friend, but he's all about the money these days if you've been keeping up with Dogecoin. Uh, I'm not a financial advisor. So in order to attract their attention, we're gonna need to throw down Whoa. a whole bunch of gold. And just like, oh gosh, it's hideous yeah. and kind of cute, but mostly hideous. Much plastic surgery, very wow. Okay, are you my friend now? But yes, if there's one thing Doge knows, it's wise monetary investment. Oh, throw him a gold ingot and you'll get a Doge coin in exchange. Yeah, again, I'm not recommending one way or another what you guys do with... <laughs> this is kind of going to get in trouble, aren't I? Look how cute it looks! Again, kind of. But if you just keep dumping your money and gold into Doge coins, certainly something good's going to happen. Uh, definitely guaranteed. Definitely results will not vary. Get back here. I want more coins, baby. Because you can use these coins, believe it or not, my friends, for some interesting trades with the villager. What do you got? Ooh. Doge. Okay. We can get the pointy doge stick for our trouble. Let's look at that. Slows down mobs when hit. Okay. We also have doge mail. Summons friendly wolf pack when damaged. I could get behind that. And then we also have doge snack. Grant speed, strength, and doge sense. Oh boy. Oh boy. I can't wait. Oh boy. Hold on a second. Now we'll show off all the gear in a second, but we can also use doge coins to damage moths by throwing it at them. And sometimes we'll get a return on our investment. 
Because occasionally what will happen... Oh, boy. Um, yeah. Oh, we can legit throw them. <laughs> I'm ready to drop it. We are throwing Doge coins, and we are getting iron for our trouble, gold for our trouble, maybe even a diamond here and there. Love. Yo, I just saw the diamond show up. Oh, he literally is my best friend. Although this isn't really doing much for damage. Maybe to the economy, but, you know, details, details. Can I kill one? Just one. Let's get one killed, huh? Duh, yeah! Literally the last one I had. Okay, let's try out the pointy doge stick. So this will slow down mobs when hit. Meanwhile, my actual pet doge... Yeah! Now they are slower. As you can see, I can uh, escape from them way more easily than before. Oh, my buddy fits right in! Get him! Yeah! Yes, man's best friend indeed. What an investment. I mean specifically in the pet, not in the coin. Yeah. So then if I grab the doge snack... And what? Do I right click with it? What do I do? Do I give it to you? Oh, he's sad. Oh, gosh. How does it work? Ooh, I don't know, but I finally just took some damage and look what happened. A pack of wolves appeared. Wow, many packs of wolves. Oh, wow, and that knocks me back way far. No, don't go in the water. We've got business to attend to. Come on, guys. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Ah, I see. So the doge snack, okay. Drop it on the ground. You guys want? Hungry? Stop it. Bad, 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 bad. Oh, oh, okay, I literally eat it. <laughs> I was like, what do I do? So I get strength, speed, night vision, all sorts of goodies. Oh, too cool. Okay, I got a really good idea, guys. So I just gave myself resistance so that I can't take any damage. Now I'm just gonna let so many packs of wolves appear that it's just ridiculous. Bring it on! Yeah, back me in that corner, baby! So many wolves, the funniest thing! <laughs> we have so many wolves that just showed up all over the place. Oh, wow, adorable, love. Man, I'm getting, wow, that's a lot of wolves. <laughs> okay, I'm sold. Such a good boy. I found a life hack. If I'm poisoned, they just keep on coming, oh. My gosh. I'm gonna get into the dog breeding business, no lie. Okay, so where are all the wolves? Maybe I need to call for them. <gasps> I'm sorry, just kidding, sorry. Too much? Probably too much. Wolves are no longer found here in the overworld, but instead, they come from the sky? <laughs> come again? They're called meteor wolves. How am I supposed to reach them? Before we see them, we need to get bones to tame these meteor wolves, which now drop from vindicators as well as villagers. Hmm, which one is which? One might be a vindicator, one might be a vill- Why are you doing this to me, Ethan? Come on! Hey, a good call indeed. All right, give me your bones, because you're not good for anything else. Uh, uh, I got a bone to pick with you. Oh, now you stuck. Oh, done deal. Thank you so much. Hey, 20 villagers later. Okay, anywho, meteor wolves have a chance of falling down from the sky. Approach it and the meteor wolf will grow. Oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> that was very <laughs> fast. Well, I want to see another. Let's see. Look at, oh my gosh, what is happening? <laughs> okay, Ethan, not gonna ask questions. Meteor wolves will grow when you approach them. Let me see, what, what have we got here? Oh gosh, big, big boy. Whoa, I, easy, well that's just magma block. Okay, so I can, let me tame, tame, tame. Do you love, do you love, eat the bones, eat. Eat the bones, eat. Hey, he loves me, look at him sitting, big boy. Dude, imagine picking this thing up from the pet store. Plus, what is this? Magnetic dust? Mm, I assume we'll get to that in a second. For now, my cutie pie, <laughs> let's have you stand. I want you to fight for me. Is he glowing? He's glowing. Whoa, this guy is definitely glowing on the sides of his body. Okay, once tamed, the meter wolf can fight for you. However, if it dies, it will cause a pretty Big explosion. Whoa. Yo, he's mad with power. Check it out. Oh, he got me a carrot. Good boy. Good again. Yeah. Nuts. So wait, is this gonna... Oh, good. I thought that button might explode him. <laughs> oh my gosh, it exploded him. What happened? Okay, I don't know what occurred, but I do want to show off the explosion. So I'm sorry, buddy. This is for your own good. Get it? Oh, he, he knows what I'm trying to do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Whoa, he had a creeper hidden inside of him. Okay, right, though. You might have noticed magnetic dust is dropped from meteors. Throw this on the ground with arrows to craft magnetic arrows. One at a time, though. The whole stack and you lose. Okay, good to know. So, here we go. 
One at a time. Look at that. Hey, these look pretty cool. What do they do? Okay, apparently mob shot with magnetic arrows will attract the meteor wolf and it will fire off its head as a mini meteor? I gotta see this. Let's try with a simple cow first, huh? Hi, Betsy. What's good? Okay, are you gonna... Oh. <laughs> it literally did. Wow. Good on you, pup. Wow, big brain. Multiple brains, apparently. Otherwise, I don't know how he would have pulled that one off. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Frozen in place. Look at that. Just keeps... <laughs> Yo, that's crazy looking. What are you doing, man? That's funny. Hey, nice effect there. Okay, let's try with the sheep instead. You get, you get shot. There we go. Love. Okay, well, that was... He made quick work of that one. Okay, how about another one? Get it, and let's see. Fires on off. That is cool. And then he begins going crazy as well. Uh-huh. Literally levitating him, and <laughs> I ain't gonna ask questions. Okay, well, must be another power he has I didn't know about. Okay, hold on a second. There's comet wolves too? <laughs> of course there are. Look at this. Wow. Love this. Okay, come here. I see the it, I see the baby inner wolf in you. It's okay, buddy. Oh, he's so friendly looking. He kind of. Comet wolves are the same as meteor wolves, but they do come with more magnetic dust when they land, and they're a little bit rarer when they show up in game. Here's some spawn eggs so we can see what's going on. Oh yeah, bo oh, wow. Okay, well it literally <laughs> I did not realize that's what was causing it. That's funny. Okay, good boys. <laughs> Somebody help me. Please bring puppy chow. Time to check out Das's sled dog. It can be tamed, so you can attach a sled and ride around. The sled dog is tamed with a new type of fish called the frost fish, and this can be made by surrounding a cod with ice. Wow, love that recipe, check it out. Very easy, you just gotta go fishing for it first. But okay, now that we've got more than enough cod and frost all up in this, we can presumably <gasps> Tame the sled dog, look! Wow, he's literally gliding across the snow. That is very powerful. Okay, his feet are moving down there. <laughs> Get over here, buddy. I want to feed you. Yeah, yo, he loves. Wow, that's a snout. So sled dogs spawn in cold biomes like this one, but to save the effort of finding one, you can... Oh, I already pressed that button. <laughs> you can feed the sled... Yeah, I did that too. Okay, a sled dog can't pull a sled if it doesn't have one, which is why you need to craft one. And this is how you do it with some spruce planks and some red wool and gelati. You got yourself a sled. Love. Before you use the sled, you need to know how to control it. The sled goes in the direction you face. You can equip the sled on the dog by clicking near it. Okay. Equip. Come here, buddy. Stop moving. Nice. You've been equipped. Hey, hey. And he's pulling me. <gasps> oh, I love. Yo, check this out. He's literally my best friend and he's pulling me around. That's cool. And wherever we look. Okay. Okay. Okay, is where we go. Can he go off-roading? <laughs> he can! Ooh, but I took some damage doing that. Okay. Oh, he even pulled me up it! Oh, I love this, actually. This is really fun. Okay, what happens if I get off of it? <gasps> he stays put. Oh, what a good... Boy. Okay, we're gonna practice our sledding skills by following this trail. yippee This is what I've been waiting for. Okay, uh, that's... He's, he's definitely taking me off-roading. Good to know he's capable. We're back on track, people. Ooh, what is that? New house alert? Hold on a second. We're gonna make a quick pit stop, buddy. What is in here? Daily Log by Jefferson T. Oh, he's my favorite author. Daily Log, March... This guy wants us to make him a grave and then also get out of his house. Okay, fine. Well, you get one or the other, dude. Play these games with me. Your dog's trying to kill me. Ugh. No, this way. Go this way. <laughs> he has got a mind of his... Oh. Yeah, I don't blame you for running. Okay, this wolf remake sounds scary. The Devourer. Thanks, Cube Developer. Oh, wow. What? Ooh. Okay. I don't know if I want to show you this one. So you're telling me wolves just have a chance of turning into this thing? Void spirits from the end possess their bodies, granting these beasts powerful- Am I supposed to take it on? Looks so, we get a special item if we defeat it, so... I guess we'll give it a shot, huh? How do I- Oh gosh, I'm nervous. <laughs> okay, let's take him out! Ooh, yeah, he's big! 
Big boy, look at those teeth. Grandma, what big teeth you have. Ooh, yikes! That's a lot of those. Oh my gosh, the fangs are crazy. Imagine just trying to look for an innocent little pup to make your own, and then this thing shows up out of nowhere. Whee! Stop, bad, bad, please, please. Okay, okay, can we talk about this a little bit, baby? Oh, no, no, no. Look, I'm sorry I didn't take you to the vet. <sighs> <sighs> but now I don't have to. Oh, think of the medical bills I saved. So these are called Devourer Fangs. And if I right click, it looks like it gives off the same power that the Devourer had. So why don't we... Can I aim it in whatever direction? Oh, wow. It literally follows the ground. Okay, so check this out. What's good, honeys? Yo! I just have bad aim. I can, I can spawn in a bunch of these, though. This is cool. Direct wall of them. Wow, and it can hit multiple at the same time. This is pretty neat. I ain't gonna lie. And we can kind of spam it. Ain't mad about it. Oh, it, it, it can damage me, though. So, you know, you might want to be careful if you're deciding to use this against any innocent animals or creatures or friends or family or, you know, yourself if you're having a bad day. Guys, comment below which wolf was your favorite and which mob you'd like to see us recreate next. And see you later. Easy does it.